Hello everybody and welcome back to another map showcase. Today I'm going to showcase a German map called Hop Hop Fuck. So let's head in and take a look at the map. And this is also a Times 4 map as well as on this map you have to download the um, global market mod from the Giants mod up to use it properly. So let's head in and take a look at the map. So we start off the game, we start off on the outskirts of the map and all the buildings there, the houses symbols are different parts of the farm, farmhouses as well. So yeah, let's take a look at the map. Yeah, the map is a large map. We have cell points uh, all around the map. We are up north here. Yeah, so what I'll do from the um, main farm, I'll head west, visit all the cell points down south. These are also farm buildings around the map, so lots of different farm buildings. Then we have the biogas plant that also has those buildings. So yeah, I'll, I'll drive um, west, visit all the cell points here, then come down south, visit everything down here, then come back and come back this direction and head up north back to the farm. This is also a multi-fruit map so you get um, all these additional crop types here on this first page and then on the second page you get a lot of additional mustard so you need a um, multi-fruit uh, machinery to use on these uh, on this map. So yeah let, let me just um, let's see what we are what are cell points. We have um, lots of cell points here most of them are in German so you can read them yourself there. So yeah, these are, I'll just put a marker there, so when I scroll down, yeah, you can read the cell points yourself, here, yeah. and then from here, yep, so these are the rest of the cell points here, so yeah, two pages of um, cell points, yeah, so those are everything here, yeah. so yeah, what I'll do, for, uh, there is traffic on the map, but it's very slow, so I'll turn it off, so yeah, so yeah, let's um, see what we have in the garage. In the garage, we have one tractor, the harvester, the runabout I'm going to use, and then the trailer. Then we have the header, and then field equipment. And then we have the front load attachments for the tractor, and the trailer for the um, harvester header. So yeah, let me just tab. Also, there are certain areas the frame rates will drop. Just zoom out a bit. So yeah, put on the frame rates. Uh, here the frame rates are uh, low, so it's a bit choppy around here. So this is the farmyard here, one of the farmyards. Then we have the greenhouses there and the vehicle shop just in the distance here. So what I'll do, I'll head this direction. We're gonna head. Uh, I'm gonna visit all the cell points. So this road is gonna take us to the first cell point, which is the biogas plant. There, this the house symbol. That's a biogas plant, and there's multiple biogas plants around the map as the map is so large. So there's about four biogas plants around the map. Yeah, so here we have the first one here. So we just drive up the road here to get to the biogas plant. Here we have the first one. So we have two bunkers and the cell point. So here is the cell point here, and then we have two bunkers here and a parking shed. So you can park your forestry, your um, biogas vehicle here. So you don't have to drive back and forth. So yeah, now we're gonna head down.
Yeah, so this road um, takes you straight up to the corner there. So it's just between 45 and 46. So we're up there down this direction, yeah? To the forestry to get out to the cell points there. Shop. Yeah, so yeah, so the first cell points are in here inside the build inside the city center. spell point is somewhere on here. I'm not seeing any selling symbol. But there is one in here inside this um, driver here. So you drive in the um, driver there and sell the crops. And up this direction. Yeah, this road just takes us up to the field there, so yeah, I didn't have to go this direction. We have a farmyard area here. So you can just make base here as well, if you want to make base. Oh, I have to go down that direction there. So over here we have a farmyard here, so you can make base in here if you want, both sides of the road. Yeah, so we have a um, storage here. Yeah, storage here and then we have the garage here so this is just storage on this side and the farmyard is on the other side there so that's the farmyard there yeah we're ready to go in you can um, explore there yourself as it's just farm buildings It's all hold up very well as we're passing through trees here. Normally the frame rates drop around um, for shares. Yeah, so up the road here we have another farm area here and two cell points. This looks like a animal farm here. So you come here and you can take care of the animals. So in here we have another cell point. Back of the building, we have the milk there, and then the crop sales point at the back here. I'll just drive in the building, oops, in the building here, and drive out. A big factory area here. Let's see this road. Yeah, this road just takes you up 
So if we go down here, there is a cell point in the grass of this building here. So as you come here, you can sell your crops here. And we have the farmyard to the left and right. Yeah, we're gonna head down now. So we're gonna make a left here as this that road continues to a dead end. Yep, and we have another biogas plant down here as well. So this is the second biogas plant. In here. Yeah, it looks like it replicates the one we visited first up the road there. So very similar. Yeah, two bunkers and the cell point. So nothing different. So let's see, from here, yeah, we're just going to follow the road um, down to the junction there. These are the cell points there, lots of cell points punched up together. Well, what I'll do, I'll head down um, onto the junction there and visit the cell point and the livestock market. For coming back because um, from the cell point here I have to continue onwards. That road takes us down to the cell points. So my bad. Yeah, this is just takes us to a dead end. So lots of forestry on this map. a cell point at the corner which looks like wood yeah the barn here so you sell your straw and grass and bales yeah it looks like wood chips there Down the road, we have the livestock market down there. So, in here, we have the livestock market. So, you come here to sell and buy animals. Yep, animals market here. So, that's the livestock market yes yeah, so now we're gonna head to the opposite side of the map now take us around
Yep, so now we're going to visit the rest of the cell points and then we have a road here taking us, a uh, paved road taking us down to those um, areas down there. So from here you just turn down here and this will take us to the building areas down here. Looks to be like a farmyard area down here. Yep, animal farm down here as well. So you come here to take care of the animals. Yeah, a large area for animals here. So it stretches all the way to the back there. Lots here. So yeah, lots to visit down here when you if you're gonna use this map. And we have a storage um, silo here, so you can store your crops. You're farming the side of the map. It's a cow, yeah, animals, so cows down here as well. Where to go? Yeah, I'm, I'm lost. Yeah, just follow the back here yep so this is the animal farm here so you just come back here and take care of the animals and over here we have the rest of the um, farmyard yeah, so sell point here. So this is a farm shop and manure. So you can sell your farm um, crops and manure there. And over here we have another um, butcher there. So it looks like that's the butcher. Yeah, we have another one. Yeah, this looks like the butcher as well from um, Farming Simulator 13 and 15. Yeah, so two cell points there. So one is a crop sales point and the butcher. And then we have the animals here as well. So you drive in there. Let me let's just go in there and check. greenhouses as well yeah this takes yeah this is um yeah the back of the um where we came from so yeah, there's two ways of getting to that far animal farm this one and then the second one there We have another animal farm. Oh, no entrance there, so I'll just drive down the grass here. Yep, so here we have another animal farm. Here. And up the road, right here, we have another one. Yeah, that road taking us straight there to the cell point. So up here we have a cell point. So the cell point is at the back. We have what looks to be like, yeah, this is the milk sales point here. And then at the back of the building, crops. So here we have the crops, either crops or, no, this looks like, yeah, milk. So you sell your milk here, my bad. So this is the milk sales point. For everything. Not crops, it's only milk. Yeah, 
Yeah, so from here, let me just stop at the road and see. From here, we have a long drive across to get the. Uh, yeah. I can just continue straight on here. Nope, not that direction. Up and across. Up here and across. See a large forestry up ahead as well. Another biogas plant. Looks like standard design as well, so nothing different here. Yeah, this map can also be used for multiplayer, as there's so many um, farmyards and biogas plants. So let's see. This one just has a let's see, cell point. Yeah, bunkers and cell point. So you have to put on the bunkers yourself. So this is the biogas plant here. S same design, two um, cell points there. Let's see if there's anything down that road. Looks like, let's just drive down there and see. I'll just drive and then come back up because, yeah, I can circle around. Come out at the back house. And circling around the um, forestry area. Yeah, that's the animal farm there. Just taking a look around. Yep, there's. Yeah, that um, road takes us back to where we came from, the animal farm down there. Deep drop there. If you were driving fast and you barrel roll down, it'll be a steep drop. So let's see from here. I can take this road across. Oh, the sawmill is straight ahead, so I have to visit the sawmill, yeah. So yeah, we're heading up to the sawmill. little shortcut thought I had to make the full rounds but yeah the shortcut came in handy Yeah, so in here we have the sawmill, main sawmill, so we have the lumber yard there. Don't see any wood chips. Yeah, it's mostly lumber. Yeah, only lumber, no wood chips. Taking us out is I didn't 
Mesida might be on the other side. Yeah, so this is the road taking us back there to the main road here. And that road continues down into the forestry. So yeah, from here, we're gonna head all the way down south, visit everything down south there. Fish farming as well there is on this map. to the cell points and fish farming so this direction there's one cell point down here Another farmyard there. So in here we have a cell point. Oh, it's the Doffel, yeah, something in German there. The cell point might be on the other side. Yeah, it's a uh, some somewhere, somewhere there's a cell point. Yeah, part of the global company. And then on the other side we have the farm there. Yep, standard farm. So let's see if there's anything further down south. Nope. We just continue back to Oh yeah, almost you know Becca Hansen. Straight. Up here. Here we have the next um, cell point here. Go inside the compound there, similar design here. So you just drive in there, sell your crops in the compound there. Then we have the lake right here. This road here will take us down to the, let's see what it's taking us to, water mill, we have the sugar free refinery and the dairy something there, and this sprig, sprig. of hairpin turns here. Around the mountain side here. So yeah, overall a very nice map, very nice um, cosplay friendly map. Lots of forestry around here as well. There's no shortage of trees. The 
here we have the dairy factory. So in here, dairy factory here. Yep, large dairy factory from Farming Simulator 13. Back here as well, there's the cell point. And then, yeah, there's one more cell point around the corner there. another farm area here so you can make base on the side of the map in case the gate opens outwards So over here we have a farm area here, so you can make, put down a soilo and store the crops. Yep, no no soilos here. Also the um on the buildings, all the um doors open. Yeah. Yeah. So this is just storage here. We just um increase speed, decrease. Yeah. yeah, I'll keep the speed there. Can't find the key to slow down the speed so while I'm walking. Yeah, so this is the farm area here where you can make base. just see something here I checked um, yeah, after exit global company left control G oh yeah so this is the global company here so when you let's see yeah this is a um, horse helper and everything so global company over you move over you Yeah, so on this map you need the global company map or uh, mod. So yeah, now we're gonna head back down. Let's see the route here yeah, and head up. Um, this is the dairy plant, and then continue up till we get to the farmyard. taking us into the forestry there. Gravel pit there, so... So back to the main road we go. Continuing north, yeah, the frames are bad around here. We have farm areas here. Let's see what this is. 
It's just a storage area for lumber, so you can store your lumber here. Little farm area here. Different types of production. Chickens, maybe? Yeah, this is a chicken um, farm. So there's a chicken farm there. So continuing up the road, we have the dairy f farm area there. So we have to head up this road here to get there. Bumpy. So here we have the dairy factory, production area, there's a dairy production. Let's see what it's called, dairy farm, so cows. Yeah, large um, coal facility for the dairy. Yep. So yeah, nice um, production area for cows and milk. Yep. So everything here for large scale production and then we have a small biogas plant here as well so that's the biogas plant at the coal facility oops wrong turn thought I had to go that way down the road and when we reach the road we'll see what else we have to visit I think we have two more um, cell points to visit and then we're back at the farm Yeah, so here we are back at the um, main road. So let's see what else we have to visit. Yeah, we have the cell points in the center of the map there. And then from there we head across to the sawmill and the port bagas plant and then back to the farm. Yeah, there's lots to do on this map and there's lots of place to put down additional factories and stuff if you want to put down factories and different production for factories so up here we have a good few cell points both sides of the road let's see if i can find them it's a little difficult to find as the on top of each other there so here we have another farmyard. Yeah, we'll go straight there first. This direction here. There we have a cell point of farm, uh, farm shop. 
we have two here inside the building you have to reverse and sell crops so yeah that's the production area there then we have the cell point there at the farm shop It's dropping as it's not um, optimized properly. So, in here we have the farm shop. Cell yep. so point here. Kalp mist, and then down the road here we have another cell point. Let's see if we can. Oh, it's a dead end. Cell point is on the main road. Okay, it's a shame you can't zoom into that map so you can see the roads much better. another one and here this is a crop sales point as well and a garage so you can upgrade the machinery so let's see how we're gonna go from here from here we're gonna continue up the road this direction here and just follow the road to the junction and then head south and across and on the opposite side you'll I'll get to the cell points Yes, yeah, some of the cell points I've missed, but those you can visit, um, like the farm buildings, farm symbols, those are main farmyards. Yeah, those you can visit because yeah, it will take a, a video a little too long to visit everything. Yeah, just if I was to visit every um, symbol on the map, it will take me uh, maybe a uh, two hours because I'll have to spend time inside the compound. Just visiting the um, cell points, the main cell points. Everything else, yeah, we'll bypass and see as we bypass. Yep, we're coming up to the junction, so we have to take a sudden turn now and just drive around the square, the forestry. This dirt road, let's see where this road, dirt road takes us to. If we continue down, this road will just take us to the lime plant, farm 5, and li lime plant. I'll visit that, I'll do that when I'm coming. No, let's do that now. So I'll just drive down there quickly and see. Lots to see on this map. There we have the Lime Station. Yep, over here we have a Lime Station.
because if there's any dirt road, there's also a storage facility here as well, so you can store your crops. Yeah, we have the other line. Nope, so that's just a dead end there. Yeah, so overall a very nice map so far. Yeah, then the farmyard, you have to drive down another road to get there. Yeah, that farmyard you can visit yourself when you're exploring the map. Yeah, I'll just continue straight here because, yeah, that shortcut. So we're going to take us back on the original route. Up to the sawmill. Two sawmills on this map. takes us back to the farm so we have to take the right turn here yeah so I'm close to the forestry let me just see it here yeah, there was a dirt road I pa yeah, passed the dirt road it will take us to that where we're going. Oop, wrong turn. Yeah, it's easy to make wrong turns. Yeah, that road just takes us to a dead um, farm. Won't worry, yeah, that's the farm we came from. Over here we have the sawmill, another sawmill. Yeah, so that's the next, that's the second sawmill there. So I'll just take this road here and it'll take us back to the main road. Continue north to another biogas plant up the road here. Last, let's see, the, yep, last um, point on our journey, another biogas plant. Yeah, similar in design, two bunkers and the cell point, so nothing new. So yeah, that's a biogas plant. So from here, you can just drive up to the road and see how we're getting out here. Let me put it up here. From here, we just drive up to the road and then back to the farm. Yeah, so this is going to take us straight back to the farm. There's a farm in the distance here, beyond the trees. Yep, so in here we have the farmyards here, windmill here. 
storage facility here. Here we have the cows. Yeah, so overall a very nice map with lots to do. So yeah, if you're gonna use this map, you have to spend a lot of time on this on the map and do a lot. So yeah, I'd like to thank you for watching, and I'll see you again next time when there's another new map to be showcased. Until then, bye for now. See you next time, and let me know what you think about the map in the description. Bye for now.